All right, so I figure I'll shoot a video on this because I have so much of it grown all over my yard in different areas. Right now it's clustered really heavily here because I threw a couple of these old down, old branches and everything down. I had berries on them from last year and they are coming up like wildfire here. So I will be cutting these down, but I'm going to let one or two grow just for making a video on it. It's life cycle, it's growth, it's it's berries and and that sort of thing. And But you can technically eat these when they're small. By the way, the name of this plant is called pokeweed. Uh, I don't know the botanical name. I'll put it in the description. But it's named pokeweed. And it's a poisonous plant. You're not supposed to eat it. But when they're small like this, and they just coming up through the ground like that, you can eat those. I never have. I've seen people eat them. But I personally feel a little uncomfortable eating it because it is a poisonous plant. I'm sure if I went to somebody's house who was preparing it and they were going to eat it, and we were all going to eat it together, I might try it then. And I'd watch them eat it first, of course, because <laughs> I'm not going to drink the Kool-Aid unless they do first, right? So... You can't technically eat this, but this is a look at it when it's young. This is its young version. It's a very prolific plant. It grows very tall. It's very invasive. It makes a lot of these blackberries, and the birds eat them. And when they eat them, they spread these seeds everywhere. And they make a root that goes down about three feet and probably, I don't know, something like that, three inches in diameter. And you're never going to pull that root out. You'll never, ever pull that root out. I've, it'll snap before you pull it out. I've tried. I've even dug them out and got them out that way, two, three feet in the ground. And then they fork off, and it's just a massive root that it puts down there, almost impossible to get rid of. So I'll let one or two of them grow. The rest I'm going to keep cutting down so it don't produce berries again. And eventually the root, I believe it's a biannual or a triannual. It'll live for one or two It'll live, live for two or three years, not one or two, but two or three years, and then it just dies. So you have to intervene at some point if you don't want it to become really invasive. But, yep, just a quick look at the early stages of the pokeweed and the leaves and everything. And when it gets bigger, I'll show you what the, you know, the full sh shape of the plant looks like the leaf profile the berries and things like that i'm not going to be taste testing the berries because they are poisonous all right so that's a quick video on the pokeweed see you on the next one